Hello and welcome to the cake tip. Today we shall be making lemon and lavender bliss balls. These are vegan, gluten free, dairy free, refined sugar free. We need eight ingredients for this recipe. To start with, we will need one and a half cups of desiccated coconut, a quarter of a cup of almond meal, one and a half tablespoons of cashew butter, two tablespoons of maple syrup, the zest of one large lemon and the juice of half of that lemon. Make sure that you're using the real fresh juice and you're not using anything from out of a bottle because it does not have the same taste. Then we shall need half a teaspoon of vanilla extract and one teaspoon of lavender. For this recipe you're going to need a food processor. It doesn't need to be a super powerful food processor because this is an easily combined mixture. You're going to start off by placing the dry ingredients into the food processor first, followed by the wet ingredients. Once you have all of your ingredients in your food processor, pop the lid on and just pulse it a couple of times to begin with. Once it's a little bit combined, then you can turn it on to full speed until it's fully combined and becomes like a dough. When your mix is ready, take it out of the food processor, pop it into a bowl to prepare to make the balls. For the balls, you will need a bowl of water to make your hands moist to roll the balls. You will need a plate to place the balls onto and your dough to make the balls. So begin by wetting your hands, put in a ball into the palm of your hands and roll in to make them circular. They need to be roughly the size of just under a golf ball. Once you're happy with the size, then continue to make them the rest, rest of them around about the same size. They should make between 12 and 14 balls in total. Continue this process until you've used all of your mix up. Once you've completed all of your balls, place them in the fridge for a couple of hours to firm up before serving. These balls keep great in the fridge for up to a week or up to three months in the freezer. I hope you've enjoyed this video and please remember to subscribe for the next video.